hello friends welcome to my channel in today's video i'll share this crochet pencil flower this one is a very cute and small flower earring so if you like my video then please do like share and subscribe my channel so let's get started so for this project we need white color um, cotton thread this one i have used pearl cotton thread then earring post and scissor and crochet hook size 0 0.60 mm and fabric glue i have used here i have used acrylic color also later you can see okay so first we'll uh, make out this flower so for this one i have made that magic ring then one chain to fix the magic ring now we'll make six single crochet first single crochet second single crochet like that we'll make six single crochet so here you can see that single cross has done six single crochet now we'll make a slip stitch on the first chain so slip stitch done now we'll make four chain with a continuation we'll make four chain one two three four four chain now we'll make slip stitch on the next stitch here you can see next stitch i'm making the slip stitch now then next stitch we'll make a slip stitch normal slip stitch okay now on the uh, now again i will make that four chain and slip stitch will make on the next stitch like the alternate way we'll make that loop okay here that slip stitch done now immediate next stitch again we'll make a normal slip stitch then after slip stitch we'll make again four chain one two three and four chain then next stitch we'll make a slip stitch like that six stitches has done now On the next stitch I'm making that slip stitch normal slip stitch okay so here I'll uh, you can see I'll get that three loops okay now on the first loop inside that loop I'm making one slip stitch that inside that loop you just insert the hook and make a slip stitch now we'll make one two two chain then we'll make double crochet so here we'll make total eight double crochet two three double crochet so total like that we'll make total eight double crochet on the same loop So here you can see our uh, that uh, total eight double crochet done. Now I'm making that two chains and one slip stitch on the same loop. So like that, that one petal has done. Now on the next loop, what we'll make? We'll normally insert the hook and we'll make a slip stitch. I'm inserting the hook and we'll make a slip stitch. Okay. Now again here we'll make two chain one two two okay now 
again we'll make total eight double crochet so here one point while we are making the first slip stitch on the loop then one chain we have to make to fix it i'm not counting that chain after that we'll make uh, make two chain that one i'm counting okay so literally if you you can say that here i have make total three chain if you have any doubt then you just uh, replay and you can see that again and after that if uh, if you have any doubt then you please do comment me on the comment box and if you like my video then please do watch do like do share and do subscribe my channel so here you can see that I eight double crochet done now I'm making two chain and inserting the hook and we'll make the slip stitch on the same okay so two petal done now one petal that one I'm making you just make yourself so we'll come after making that petal okay so here you can see uh, that two chain also done now I'm um, doing the slip stitch on the same loop okay okay so here the three petal done now we'll make a slip stitch on the back you just turn the flower then back you can see here one loop while you are inserting the hook you can see one loop so here you just insert the hook and uh, pull the thread and make a slip stitch you can see carefully where i am inserting the hook back side one loop is there now i am doing a slip stitch okay so now after slip stitch you make four chain one two three four four chain okay four chain done now on the next flower petal here also one loop so you just insert the hook and make a slip stitch here you just make a slip stitch slip stitch done okay so slip done now we have to turn it then I'm making a, a four slip stitch on the chain four chain four slip stitch okay four chain four slip stitch one two three four like that i'm making that four slip stitch okay so here that four slip stitch i'm making okay. here uh, i'm making that slip stitch because i don't want to make a uh, um, it back means uh, after slip stitch when I'm making that uh, double crochet that time um, after four chain if I make that double crochet directly then it will shown as back side so I want to avoid this one so that's why I am making slip stitch means second round then I'll make that double crochet okay so after slip stitch I have done then three chain then we'll make triple crochet so here at first we'll make total six double crochet and if you don't know how to do triple crochet how to do double crochet in my channel on my channel one basic crochet stitches video is there so you guys you guys please check that video okay so here you just make total six triple crochet in triple crochet we may we just take the loop two times in double crochet we just take the loop uh, take the thread uh, one time and triple crochet we are just taking that two time that is the difference okay so after six triple crochet here that six triple crochet has done okay now we we'll make one double crochet one double crochet on the same loop we'll make one double crochet 
ओके देन आफ्टर वन डबल क्रॉसे अगेन विल मेक सिक्स ट्रिपल क्रॉसे यू कैन सी अगेन आई एम मेकिंग सिक्स ट्रिपल क्रॉसे So here you can see a uh, six double crochet done. Now we'll make a three chain and we'll make a slip stitch on the same loop. So here you can see that uh, our flower has done. This is a cute and small and tiny flower, fancy flower. Okay, uh, so. I'm, I'll cut the extra thread okay now here another uh, one small round i'll make with a magic ring uh, at first uh, we'll make the magic ring then uh, three chain then we'll make 12 double crochet three chain done now we'll make total 12 double crochet Okay, so here 12 double crochet done now I'm making the slip stitch on the first chain okay so here our small round has done now I'll cut the thread now we'll color the flower okay so for that one I need one small bowl with a plain water and one palette and here I have used one small this so here I am using that fabric uh, acrylic color yellow color blue color and white color I'll mix and match and uh, the um, brush I have used two type uh, 20 point acrylic something number and one is 25 So at first you just tip the water, okay then you just directly you can apply the yellow color inside, in between you just use that little bit water, as it's a um, cotton, uh, 
on cotton thread so that's why it will uh, easily soak the color and water okay so like that you just see how i am coloring that flower So here you can see that our flower has done now let it be dry for a few hours it will not fade the color or it will not get out the color so here that back side i'm tied the thread now i'll uh, attach the ear post with the help of glue okay so here you can see how i am attaching that ear post with the help of glue and uh, that small color round i have done so that one i'll attach it you can see the small color round
so after applying the glue let it dry for uh, at least five to six hours okay so that's all my cute small pensive flower earring has done so hope you like it so please subscribe my channel and thank